Everest Fibrin Sealant Patch Application. Product Preparation. Everest enables first attempt hemostatic efficacy right out of the box and comes in ready to use sterile packages. To open the product, after removing the foil pouch from the carton, carefully peel open the foil pouch. Remove the tray and place onto the sterile field. Hold the tray securely, ensuring that the side with the holes is facing upwards. Use the tabs on the side of the tray to remove the top with the other hand. The lower portion of the tray contains Everest with the active side facing downwards. The active side is powdery in appearance. The non-active side has an embossed wave pattern. Keep Everest dry after opening. The patch can remain in the sterile field for use throughout the procedure. Application. Everest may be applied on the surface of soft tissue bleeding as well as to the liver. Using sterile scissors, carefully cut the patch to the size and shape needed to maintain contact with the bleeding area with an overlap of 0.5 to 1 inch or 1 to 2 centimeters. Keep the powdery active side facing down while in the tray. Remove excess blood or fluid from the site of application to improve visibility. Do not use Everest on non-visualized surfaces or on visible open large vessels. Apply the active side of the patch to the bleeding area. Allow full contact with the tissue. Everest is activated upon contact with fluid and then adheres, conforming to tissue with manual compression. Apply a sufficient number of patches to adequately cover the entire bleeding area, including the prescribed overlap. Use the least number of patches to cover the bleeding area. Hold dry or moist laparotomy pads or surgical gauze over Everest to achieve full contact with the bleeding surface. Immediately apply manual compression over the entire surface of the patch to ensure hemostasis, including the area of overlap. Maintain manual compression for three minutes. Gently remove pads or gauze from the site without dislodging Everest or the clot. Inspect the patch to ensure that it is in full contact with the treated area. If placement of the patch is unsatisfactory, remove it and use a new one. Retreatment. If not satisfied with the placement, or if major crimps, folds, or creases occur, remove the first patch and repeat the application with the new patch. Bleeding may continue if the patch insufficiently covers the entire bleeding area. Apply additional patches if bleeding continues. Incomplete adherence to the tissue may also result in continued bleeding. If this occurs, remove the patch and use a new one. Everest works on the first attempt and is absorbed in approximately eight weeks. 
discard unused, opened patches at the end of the procedure.